be in God's will? Sometimes you say, oh, I've been praying, Pastor, I know, I've been praying for this, I've been praying for that. But the question is, is that God's will? It's not just a question of praying. We must pray, yes, but are we praying in God's will? And sometimes the reason why we do not really like the will of God because it contradicts to our will. You cannot pray in the will of God and not have a surrendered heart. You must be surrendered. Lord, thy will be done. Lord, kung imong kabubuton, Lord, nga muad to ko sa Manila, ugma, Lord, pero na nakay tiket sa alas city sa buntag, kung imong kabubuton, ginoo, tabangi in town ko, Lord, kay alas city sa buntag, unya, musakay ko sa Philippine Airlines, wana, na na kay, wana, unsa sa nagampu pa ka sa will of God, nga naana. na 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 kay tiket. The will of God means, Lord, gusto ba ka mo ato ko sa Manila? Kay, o dili, di ko pala tiket. That's the will of God. Lord, gusto ba ka nga mo niya kung negosyo? Kay, dili ko mo invest ani, or dili ko mo himong anak. Lord, maobag yun ning bayhana nga gusto ni mo, Lord. Pakita ko, Lord. Lisod ka na, lisod na. Kay, mabla, mag, sometimes our emotions can... Lord, kanang will... Ay na lang, Lord. Ay, ganahan dito niya, Lord. <laughs> Wana ang ginoo na padapli na. Wana. Unya ayha na lang ta unya na lang ta magmahay, hilak nya. Anyway, number 4. <laughs> I think you get the point, amen. Ha? Huh? Okay. We are to pray in obedience. Psalm 66 verse 18. Now what is the command? The command is this, Psalm 66:18. 6618 Psalm. The Bible says, If I regard or allow iniquity in my heart, the Lord will not hear me. Is there sin that is unconfessed today that needs to be confessed? Digi ka matubag sa imong pagampo sa Dios kung naisala sa imong kasing kasing. Kinahalan ipangayo ginagpasaylo. It is foolish to pray if we have unconfessed sin in our hearts and in our lives. If God were to bless us and answer our prayers, when we know we are not right with Him, then He would be reinforcing and even enabling us to sin. So, Pastor, come on, tell you, I'm going to say, okay, man. Dili ang ginoo ng tubag si mo mga pag-ampo. Lain ang ng tubag si mo mga pag-ampo. Not like we blessing. Hey, by the way, the devil can also bless you. Don't forget that. The Bible says in Proverbs, the blessing of the Lord, meaning there is a blessing not of the Lord. Because the, the verse specifies there. The blessing of the Lord, it maketh rich, and he addeth no sorrow with it. So just because na kay material blessing, just because na kay position, just because na yana, Nga, dili, nga, naanas, dili tanan, dili tanan. So that's why you have to really be sensitive and surrendered to the Lord. We are to pray in obedience. The nation of Israel, God planned that this nation would be under Him and He would lead this nation to be a shining light to all the other heathen nations. But they looked and they said, Gusto sad mi na ami hari. Instead, ang Diyos na ilang hari. Gusto gis lag human nga hari. And so they chose a, a wicked king over the righteous king, God Himself. So many times, because of their disobedience, great famine, great disasters, and calamities would come upon the nation because of their not being obedient to God. We are to pray in obedience. Number five, we are to pray in fellowship. Mark 11.25, we're surveying anything, the verses that talk about, that teaches about prayer. Okay? Mark 11.25, and when ye stand praying, forgive. Say, forgive. Kusga. Forgive. For if ye have ought against any, that your Father also which is in heaven may forgive your trespasses. 26. But if ye do not forgive, 
neither will your Father which is in heaven forgive your trespasses. Maybe there is unforgiveness in your heart, unforgiveness to your spouse, unforgiveness to your children, children to their parents, unforgiveness among siblings, unforgiveness among neighbors, unforgiveness among co-workers, unforgiveness among uh, uh, aunties, relatives, unforgiveness sa, sa atong mga gitawag nga mga mga uh, uh, kaning business partners. There's a lot of sources of unforgiveness. Maybe your prayers are not being answered. Our prayers are not being answered because there is hatred, there is grudges. We are harboring a grudge in our heart towards someone else. And we cannot expect, you cannot expect God to answer our prayers if there is unforgiveness. In fact, this is very specific among husband and wife. And I would like to mention this in 1 Peter 3, 7. Likewise, ye husbands, dwell with them, with your wife, according to knowledge, giving honor unto the wife as unto the weaker vessel, and as being heirs together of the grace of life. Notice the last part of the verse. That your prayers be not Hindered. Nga man ni pastor, nga nung anak man na ang ginoo, pastor, nga man, kay gusto yun siya, nga dili lagi ta mag-away, nga wala masol ba nga tong problema. Bisag na ay misunderstanding, you come to an understanding and forgiveness. Let not the sun go down upon it. That's a mechanism in marriage. It's a good mechanism by the way. Dili ni mo basta-bastahon ang inyong kaminyon, ang atong kaminyon, folks. Importante na, it has a great part in answered prayer. That is why we do not enter into marriage lightly nor unadvisedly. Why? Because ang atong prayers magdepindi na sa atong kaminyon. Niya, imong naminyo, unbeliever. <clears throat> imong naminyo, dili sa Diyos. <clears throat> diba? So, lisod, lisod. Lisod. Mo na mag-pray ka, Lord, luwasan niya akong paris, Lord. Kung naanak ka diya, Lord, luwasan niya akong paris, Lord. Maura na yung prayer ng tubagon sa ginoo, ang kaluwasan sa usa katao. Pero ka nang adlaw-adlaw na itong prayer, grasya na lang na sa ginoo. Ha? Nga maka padayon to padayon lang gyud po forward gyud ta gyud. Amen. Move forward gyud ta. So we are to pray in prayerfully diri sa atong room karon sa atong auditorium sa atong church walay unforgiveness ha. Maybe this side mo tan-aron human na ni pastor mo human na ni mag closing na ni asa ko mo agi. Kay basig adto to mo agi didto diri ko mo agi. Ayaw. Lastly, we are to pray in faith. Alright, we're talking about faith. The component of prayer in faith and the component of faith in prayer. But listen, if we do not pray in Jesus' name, if we do not pray in the Spirit, if we do not pray in the will of God, if we do not pray in obedience, if we do not pray in fellowship, kaning atong bisag unsa pa nakahugot imong pagtuo sa ginoo kung dili nimo si tulo ning unang lima, wa ni. Matthew 21, 22. We'll close with these verses. Matthew 21, 22. And all things whatsoever ye ask in prayer, everybody say the word. Believing. No, Lord, usba ni akong anak, kani akong mga bata. Paliw, Lord. Lord, hilak pa. In Jesus' name, Amen. Ni Agi mo mga nakakaw. Ay, mga demonyo na naman rin. Pawa mo, nag-ampo ko. Mag-upagay ka nang humag-ampo. Kasamo pa ninyo, nag-ampo ko. Giampuan ninyo sila. Ngayon mo mga bata, nga matarong. Hindi, gitawag ni mga demonyo. Mga pasaway ni mga bata, Adrik. Tawa mo. Hindi, ginamausag. Lord, akong ba na usba? Lord, 
niya nasaday. Why pagtuo ba? Huh? Sa ino, huwag di ito magbantay. Huwag di ito magbantay. We find ourselves doing that. Lord, salamat sa pagkaon. In Jesus' name, amen. Ah, manok nga sad. Sige, tagmanok ka na eh. Huwag ko pa kayo nagpasalamat. Nagpasalamat. Yud ka, yud. Ah, napaing na sad. Sige, lang ka paing. Parata, aning sabaw. Bago pa kayo ka nagpasalamat. Nagpasalamat. Ang pangunta, nagpasalamat. Bagi ta. Basahan na ito balik. All things whatsoever you ask in prayer. Everybody? Oh, kana. Tuara. Ha? Nindot ang prayer. Uy. Dili, dili, sayup ang ginoo. Sakto ang ginoo kanunay. Huwag yung problema ang ginoo. Naarag yung problema ba sa ato? Ato lang tarongon. Tarongon na to. ni Okay lagi ni. Maka-move forward yung daan eh. Salamat sa Bible. Salamat sa Word of God. Salamat ni Jesus Christ. Salamat sa Holy Spirit. Salamat sa forgiveness of sins. Have you been to Jesus for the cleansing? Parang matag kanta na ito kanina, di ba? Are you washed in the blood of... Mawag ito kanta? Ato na lang idugang. Ah, there is power day. There is power, power. Oye, ayaw ninyo. Yama-yama ang blood of Jesus. Kay ugway blood of Jesus. Dita pa sa iloan. Why ka pa sa iloan? Amen? Nindot. Nindot ka yung ginoon. Nindot ka yung Christian life. Nindot ka yung faith. We just have to live it. Don't be afraid. Amen? Replace fear with faith. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for this blessed morning. Thank you for your blessed word. Thank you for the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you for the Holy Spirit of God. Oh Lord, I pray that we will truly, truly move forward in faith by looking at our prayer life and many times our failures are prayer failures our failures in our relationships our failures in our decisions our failures in our blessings many times they are prayer failures uh, lord if if your answers to us are denials help us to accept it if your answers to us are delayed lord help us to wait if your answers to us are better than what we prayed for, help us to be grateful. And Lord, even if, even when you also answer us directly, Lord, help us to develop not just a prayer time, but a prayer life. I pray that you will bless this time of invitation. While your heads are bowed and eyes are closed, the first invitation this morning,